um, so as you can see before, I went to the store, um, had a really busy morning, and I had every intention of taking you guys along in the morning, but it was just like, go, go, go. But drop trial, y'all, had me by appointment. I forgot he was getting shots, so he got shots. So that took a minute, and then he's doing okay. He's currently looking at me right now, his walker. And then we went to the grocery store, and then I got me some coffee and food because I have yet to eat in all morning, and it is cold. 1222 right now. So I'm gonna do a quick grocery haul because I have to run back out soon, like 15 minutes to go get Miss Charlie. Um, so I'm gonna do a quick grocery haul, show you guys what I got. It's just some of the basic stuff that we needed in the house. Um, and then when I come back, I have some things I need to do around the house. So I'll take you guys along with me. And so this uh, blog is like a motivational, you know, reset, clean your house, organize your house type blog. Um, He's so cute because he's just smiling at me. But anyways, so um, let's get into the grocery haul. Okay, so the first thing we got is some potato bread. We get a lot of bread because we do like to freeze it as well. It, it doesn't like mess up the bread if you put it in the freezer. So that's a little hack if you didn't know, put some bread in the freezer. Um, and then we got Sarah Lee uh, Artisan. Artisan? I'm gonna say it wrong. Bread. <laughs> And then we got some applesauce, because we like applesauce in this house. I got some Crystal Light um, peach iced tea made with black tea to make uh, pitchers of tea. It's really good. And then we got some Diaper Genie pills, some yogurt, and laundry detergent. And then we got, uh -oh. we got some Pampers for Levi. And we got some pull-ups from Miss Charlie. Okay, next we got some Parmesan cheese. Y'all, this Parmesan cheese, fire, so good, so good. Pizza bites, because we all like them, and Charlie especially loves some pizza bites. Some uh, Sargento Kobe, back, Kobe Jack cheese sticks. Get my words twisted up there. And then we have some, uh oh we got some pasta sauce, the Classico tomato and basil. And then some frozen bagels. They taste better once if they're if you get them from the frozen section of BJ's. BJ's, I'm not sure if you can get them from like Costco or Sam's Club frozen, but the frozen ones taste better once you warm them up. So get them frozen. And then I got some things as chicken thighs, ground turkey, and then so yeah, some chicken breast. And I believe that's it for our little grocery haul. So let's put these groceries up. You know, sidebar, I'm watching Goosebumps on Disney. It's on Disney and Hulu. But I'm watching Goosebumps and I don't know where we put it on because I kind of wanted to watch something scary, um, but not too, too scary. Um, and I didn't think it would be this creepy, but it's kind of creepy in my opinion to be on a kid's network. I guess Disney network. I don't know if Disney is just like, it's not for kids, but I don't know, I wasn't expecting it to be this creepy, but it's really good. So if you like um, little scary, little creepy, check it out. I think it's only five episodes, super easy to watch. Um, and I'm just watching because I want to figure out the mystery because it's the mystery behind it. And I'm really, like, I just keep watching because I want to know what happened. So let me know in the comments if you're watching it or what you're currently watching.
Wednesday. And I know I had plans on showing you guys how I did the pantry and I had a whole thing. I was gonna clean up the third floor. I was gonna do a whole bunch of stuff on Monday and show you guys. Well, um, I don't know if I mentioned it, but Levi got his shots done on Monday. And um, he, those shots took him out. Like, they took, they took my man out. So, he wasn't feeling well. I just started out to feel good. Charlie wasn't feeling well. So, it was just like a combination of things that was just happening on Monday. And I just didn't have the mental capacity to show you guys anything or even pick up the camera or anything like that. So, um, it is now Wednesday. Yesterday, I did do the pantry. Um, and I'll show you, like, I'll show you the before and I'll show you how it looks now. Um, just so you can see um, what bands I added. It's not like a, it's a change, but it's not like too much of a crazy change, if that makes sense. Oh my gosh, I took that road. Sorry, I'm talking out loud to myself. Um, so anyways, I'll show you that. I still didn't touch the third floor yet because I just haven't had the energy or time to do so. Uh, so we will actually probably tackle that this morning because I'm feeling okay and hopefully Levi will let me do so. So yes that is kind of the update um yeah and also oh this is so random but me and Nakia celebrated five years of marriage on Sunday and I'll insert, insert a picture here we went to a uh winery um down like in Kings Mountain area I'll put the information down below in case you guys want to check it out if you're like local Charlotte local to Charlotte um, so we did that on Sunday, and then we went to Target, and I insert that picture too. And then, um, after Target, we stopped to buy Chipotle, and then we went to an ice cream shop. So, um, we're gonna turn here. Okay, y'all, I'm, I'm just really thinking out loud, so I'm going to get myself some, um, Chick-fil-A this morning because I just don't feel like I'm getting any breakfast, so I'm gonna go to Chick-fil-A, and I'm gonna go home. And then the goal is to work on the third floor. That is that is the goal, to work on the third floor. So, anyways, I just wanted to kind of give an update what's been going on with us. And um, I guess we're going to plan start for today. So, come along with us, guys. We're home. I had to go to a different Chick-fil-A because the one I was going to um, by charter school was wrapped around the building. And Levi wasn't going to make it. And neither was I. So, um, we went to a different Chick-fil-A. And I told myself this morning I wanted to go to Home Goods and TJ Maxx to kind of just look around see what they have for Christmas. And I'm like, no, I'm going to wait till tomorrow because today's kind of a busy day. Especially like this evening. It's a busy evening. And I was like, no, I'm going to just wait. Probably have like a full busy day. I was right across the street from there, y'all. And I'm so proud of myself because I still didn't go. I didn't go. So, we got Chick-fil-A. And turn on the TV because I got a two hash brown bowls, um, like the hash brown egg bowl. But what I did was I don't get the hash browns in it. I just get the cheese, chicken, and egg in it. It's a healthier option, guys. To do it this way, and um, so that's what I got because this, this is bowls full of protein. Okay, um, and I'm like super hungry, so I got two. So don't judge me. <laughs> but it's full of protein. So just combine it in a big bowl. <laughs> and then I'm either gonna use um some sriracha or the jalapeno sauce. I think I'm gonna use both. But this is really good paired with this. So just wanted to show you what I got, guys. Um from Chick-fil-A. And then let me show you the pantry so I don't forget. Okay, so here's the pantry. So I added those bins up here and I made this like lunchbox area chips and like other chips we have, but we don't really eat that often. This is also the same. I need to change the labels on that. Um, this down here is kind of the same as well where I keep all the cans and sauces. Um, this is what changed the most. So I had these two already 
and um i just they were over on this side but i moved them over here oh, let me turn the light back on <laughs> and then um i we got these the other day so i have applesauce oatmeal and then i run them back here had this one already as well just left the peanut butter honey and jelly and stuff in there these two are new this is like a snack bin kind of coffee breakfast bin a little bit and then this is like our sweet bin um and if you're wondering why we have so many of these these are a cookie from england or wells i should say that nikia absolutely loves so when we go we always like stock up on stuff um this is kind of still the same as well um i did move that bin down here with like extra baby bottle stuff medicines in the back as you can see a kid was in here messing with that um and this is still the same here because i'm just not really sure what to do with all the drinks that's the pantry um it's not super like aesthetically pleasing because i just believe life is in that way um but um it's functional and that was the main goal to make it functional for us um, especially with adding food for more kids and stuff like that we wanted to make it functional so got those bins from target and i think I think they still have them like online where I can link them. So I'll link them for you guys just in case you're interested in getting some. Um, but you can honestly find containers everywhere. You can find from the dollar store, Target, Walmart, the container store, Amazon. Like you can literally find them everywhere. So it is. Let me go eat and then we're going to go to the third floor. Okay, so I'm on the third floor and I'm going to show you how it looks. It's not terrible. It's just some stuff I just want to throw away. Some stuff I just need to organize. So let me show you how it looks. And then we're going to clean. So this is all the stuff <laughs> that's just on the floor. That's piled up. This is the other space here, which I need with the bed. And my desk is kind of messy. Messy. <laughs> messy. So we're about to get to cleaning this. Before I get started, I wanted to show you some stuff that I picked up from thrift stores and ooh, Target for Christmas that I found. First thing was this Christmas tree. It, you can't put a candle or anything in it, but it's going to be so cute on my folding shelves. I think I paid, oh, here it is, <laughs> $2.99 for this at the thrift store. And then I got these pretty... Um, I think they're called god what are these like fillers i can't i can't think of the name for them but i got these velvet like ball um picks this is called picks for <laughs> christmas from hobby lobby they were 3.99 and they were half off so i only paid a dollar no two dollars um for each one and i got five of them so i got those from hobby lobby and then from target i got this gingerbread no clue what i'm gonna do with it i just been loving gingerbread gingerbread is for the holidays so i got this and i honestly might put it in the coffee bar and stick something in it but it was in the um target dollar section it was only five dollars and then i got these little mini christmas trees and i think it would be so cute by the big one i might try to find some medium ones um i don't know if i can stick a candle in it i'm not sure yeah i don't i don't know if i can stick a candle in it um so that's what i got and then i got two more as well and you can hear leave my story and then i also got some cute gingerbread christmas uh christmas bags <laughs> take my words together say y'all christmas bags um from the dollar section at target and they were only a dollar and i got four of them so i got that and then i got this I got this cute shopping bag. Hey. Hey. I got this cute shopping bag. So whenever I go shopping for Christmas gifts, I'm going to take it with me so I can fit my stuff in there. So that is all I got. And now I'm about to start cleaning. You know just what you do, you do to me Play my emotions like a pair of puppet strings Did it ever occur to you, my heart's more than a toy Please go easy on me, babe Send message after message, forward my call 
Next day you hit me back like nothing happened at all. What about all the things you used to say to me? This ain't the way it's supposed to be. And you know, I wouldn't do that to you. You know, I wouldn't treat you that way. No, I've been running, can't catch up. Oh, love, what I won't do. These days I just don't know Pick a fence in the valley I hope it's losing its hold You know the mother girls will love you like I do Can't afford to give up on you And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wanna treat you that way No I've been running can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls this corner cleaned out this is just christmas stuff that i'm keeping here for now um because once christmas comes that will be completely cleaned out but there's nothing on the floor anymore and then i need to move the exercise ball for his bouncer back downstairs and put that board up wipe it off um the bed is made looks clean and then my desk looks a little bit better this stuff over here is the core thing i'm gonna put up behind here and then this cricket stuff and then that's another monitor that i need to put on the desk but i need to find something to put my cricket stuff on first um and then i put the monitor up there and then it should be all good to go so yeah this is the final little area space i really want to change 
this entire bed, guest bedroom, like comforter, bedding, all that. The wall, I really want to change all that, but I have no clue how I want to do it yet. So, yeah. I'm really surprised that this silk press is still lasting. Yes, I know it's still like, it's frizzy and whatnot, um, but I'm just surprised my hair has not completely reverted back to its natural state. But anyways, I am rambling. I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know it was kind of chaotic a couple of days, but I hope this vlog gave you some motivation to clean a space, organize a space that you've been wanting to do for a while now. Um, so thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video with a family member or friend to help support my channel. So I do appreciate everyone who does watch and support and let me know that you do watch because that makes me really happy. But anyways, I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.